Hello Magnus, Mats Hoffman here. So, here is the video in English. It's about the problem that I discovered uh, from a customer who was complaining that the rotisserie for the gravity grill was stopped rotating. So I, I, uh, I looked into the problem and it seems that it's actually a mechanical problem on this one. And I will show you. The motor is fitted on the outside of the grill and then you screw it into the, onto the grill with this flange from the inside and what happens is that this adapter is a little bit too long actually to fit inside here. I can show you that. So when you, what you do is you, you screw this from the inside of the grill like this and when you tighten it, as you said in the manual, you will tighten it like this. And what you can see now is that you can't see any threads here. So it's X bottom onto the threads. So it's tight and firm. So if you fit this one inside, it will be too long. I can show you. I will show you that. So this is the way you, sh you are doing it on the grill. So you put this adapter, as I call it, and then you put it in and then you tighten this one up so it's tightened now what you can see here is that I haven't got this um, flange to the bottom of the thread so there are still missing two three millimeters here and what is stopping it to coming in is actually the adapter so the adapter is stuck in here now so this one will not rotate at all so I thought that one quick solution maybe be to just un tie this a little bit so it will get a little bit loose in here but what can happen now is that when the rotate when the rotisserie is rotating you can actually start to rotate this one as well and it will be tightening that as much as it will not uh, rotate any longer so there is an easy fix for this as I see it you just cut this adapter by five millimeters or so so it will actually fit inside this flange so so what they need to do is to make this a little bit shorter from the factory or make this longer easy fix that's all thank you